one hour uptime and then the run starts? Yeah, dude. The disc specialty. Let's do this, chat. You know, I'm gonna kill the lizard. Timer? Yeah, we always need the timer. Yeah, so... In this... Oh my god. This fucking controller is so scuffed. So, in this mod, if you're locked on, you can do the Bloodborne dash. Heavy. Am I playing with a Mad Cats controller? No. Your PS4 controller you use for PC got dick. Well, you can. PS4 controllers can be taken apart pretty easily, so. You could, like, unscrew it and try to. I don't know what your issue is, but maybe you could fix it. This lady has all the good shit. The fuck? Tomato? Okay, I don't know what this is, but... Alright, chat. The Whirly Gig Saw. A vicious weapon forged with outlandish craftsmanship, first wielded by a deranged individual who sought nothing but to witness the rending of flesh. This weapon pummels opponents in its mace form, but its true strength lies in its attached mechanical saws. These discs, lined with serrated teeth, spin rapidly, thrashing the flesh of those before it into fine shreds. Skill, spin bash, shredding stance. Bash foes with a large spinning motion. When transformed, enter a stance that continuously slashes foes. Use the normal or strong attack to slash the weapon along the ground on either side. Alright, so, 
We don't have the required souls for this, so I am going to have to uh, hacker man real quick. Yeah, I don't know how many souls this is. Okay, that's a bit excessive. The Whirly Gig Saw. The Rikuyo has 40 dex requirement? Oh my god. Well, good thing the Whirly Gig Saw has really low requirements. Ash Let's buy the blueberry, the peach, yes, peach. <laughs> there is pale pine bundle and human pine bundle. Dude, my fucking controller, stop, stop fucking doing that, please, for the love of fucking god. All right, let's just buy a piece. I, I don't want to. I don't want to use. I don't want to have too many souls. Grotto hat. Hexer hood. Oh, they got some of the armor from uh from. Oh, they have this. Huh. They have this arm. armor looks kind of weird with this. <laughs> All right. Can somebody up could a mod update the mod command and put mod in my like put mod uh, exclamation mark mod in my title. Yeah, so it has all of the move set from the game. The fucking controller, though. This controller is triggering me so much. I might have to switch back to a different controller. It is constantly fucking moving on its own. Try to calibrate it. It's not... I don't think it's a calibration issue.
I'm wired. Oh, let me go. Go get some more Estus. with? I actually have no idea. So cool. Is it buffable? I don't know. I'm gonna grab the gold pine to find out. No, it's not. Dang it. Maybe you can buff it. Maybe you can. Oh my god. This. I love fighting my camera. It's so good. Buff. I mean, this mod only works on current pad. This mod is better than Cinders. I mean, it's not really comparable to Cinders. Please, for the love of God, camera. like my control like see like I aim to the right and then my controllers like no you're going back to the left that my controller is doing this okay I, I can't I can't I fucking can't I need to go <laughs> hold on I have a few different controllers I can use this is fucking infuriating I actually have like five different controllers. Ah, the wait has been long, unkindled one. I am a what a
God, all of my controllers are so fucking scuffed. What the hell? I'm fucking cursed. I'm fucking cursed, dude. Ghost of Tsushima. Ghost of Tsushima isn't out yet. I might make a New Zealand PSN account and buy the game with that, but I already I already bought the game once, so that means I would have to buy the game twice to be able to play it like fucking 10 hours early. So I don't know. I'm probably just gonna wait. At this point. That's some really good damage. Wow, the charger too though, that is that is strong. I need to turn down my fucking volume though. Okay, that should be a lot better now. It's really soft now? Oh my god. What do you mean? Is it really too quiet now? It's fine, okay. Do a baby raid next time you raid someone. <laughs> God, this controller I'm using right now feels so scuffed. This controller is like fucking sticky. Like, what the fuck happened to this controller? Somebody fucking coom on it? Dude. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yo, what the what the fuck? That was unexpected. <laughs> hey, yo, e boy Trey, thank you for the, thank you so much for the 50 gift subs out of nowhere, dude. Thank you, man. That was certainly unexpected. Thank you, man. It's Nems, his most beloved sugar daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, man. Oh, not dead. 
dude, it's... It's so sick, though, that there's Bloodborne weapons in DS3. It's so fucking cool, dude. Okay, hold on. I actually... I need, I'm gonna switch controller again. This fucking controller is, like, actually fucking sticky. It's fucking gross, dude. I don't know what fucking happened to that controller. Don't worry, I have I have five controllers, guys. If this one doesn't work, I can use another. Oh god. Get over here, doggo, you... <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh my god, look at- see, this is what's wrong with all my controllers. This guy- this controller can't run straight. Look at my fucking character, dude. <laughs> Fuck's sakes. Oh my god. Yo, oh, thank- Oh my god, my hands feel like they're covered in fucking... Oh god, this is awful. Yo, thank you so- I, I, I need my hand sanitizer, one sec. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Jesus Christ. Thank you so much, Trey. Why don't I get rid of or fix the controllers that are bad? Oh, I don't know. I just keep them. I keep them for my collection. <laughs> oh my god. This controller is also so scuffed. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, hold on. Let me try a different one. Oh god, I dropped it. It's fine. Okay. Alright, I can run straight. I can run straight pretty much with this controller. Oh my god. Oh, this is so stupid. Yo, Hoffinator, thank you for the prime sub, man. Also, uh, Zeus, Zeus, he, what was it? Zeus Lord AFK, something like that. Thank you, thank you so much for the... Thank you for the sub, dude. And Trey again, thank you for fucking 100, 100 gift subs, man. Out of Estus. The only thing that's well, I'm I'm not gonna say. Oh, come on. The only thing that would be nice. So in this mod, oh come on. Uh, in this mod, you can't you can't transform the weapon while running, which is kind of weird. But I do know. I think they're gonna release like an update for the mod uh, soon, which adds like running, running transform attacks. And uh, 
some other stuff like that. I, th I think they're changing some stuff with the mod soon. Too heavy. Crap, I really don't want to wear this, but I'm too fucking heavy otherwise. <laughs> this looks so fucking weird. Oh, what the hell? I have a dagger. Nope. When am I playing the firearms mod? Uh, the firearm mod is kind of... It's kind of, it's kind of gets boring. <clears throat> yeah, we got the double shield. Well, it just gets, like, repetitive. I don't know. Yo, what's up, Dylan? Can I do Stake Driver in my next Bloodborne run? Uh, yeah, maybe. We'll see. I'm not sure why I'm going this way. I guess we're gonna go backwards. <laughs> There's a mod for Bloodborne Attire plus Physics Fix. Hmm. Interesting. You watch Soldier Boy stream SpongeBob. Yeah, I saw that Soldier Boy has been streaming RuneScape. <laughs> it's fucking. <laughs> it's so weird. <laughs> What a time to be alive. I never thought, <laughs> I never thought when I was a kid playing RuneScape that I would someday see Soldier Boy playing it on Twitch. Peeps streaming Death Stranding. <laughs> That's a bad joke. Wait, what's a bad joke? Oh, is that, is that guy, he's not a, oh, I don't, I, guys, I don't, I didn't know that, I'm sorry. I don't, <laughs> I don't keep up with that. Now I feel bad, <laughs> my bad, my bad.
Yeah, congrats to anybody who got a sub from Trey. Enjoy all the new emotes. What the fuck are you doing, Stray? Trying to break his legs, he's not letting me though. Oh, there we go. Uh, uh, you're supposed to. What? Did they change Stray Demon in this fucking mod? What the. Okay. Also. Okay, I just realized, why do my fists do more damage than my whirly gig saw? What the fuck is that? Why are my fists so OP? <laughs> what the fuck? Hello? <laughs> well, that's strange. Yo, Hoden, thank you for the... Thank you so much for the nine months, man. It's a PvP mod for banned players. Yeah, I know. I know it's like a P... I know it's... Well, it's not... It's not just PvE or PvP, but yeah, I, I know that it's like mainly for PvP, but... I can't fucking hit it. Okay. Punch it? No, no, no. Oh, there it is. There it went. What the fuck? Why? <laughs> what? Why is it? It just... Why is it disappearing? I'm hitting it. Oh, the uh, it's cool though. The running R, the running R2 is still uh the running R2 is still in the game or it's it's on this weapon. The running R2 is freaking sick with this weapon. Okay. These lizards are freaking hard to hit. Alright, I need to get a different chest piece, dude. Fuck, fuck this giant shield. Uh, what else can I get? Chain armor. Rato robe. That's pretty expensive. Fuck it. The, the L2 does work like the whirly gig. I used free money mod? Yeah, and I, I didn't use any of the money on... Alright, we got plus four whirly gig, dude. Let's fucking go. Uh, wait, what is the scaling on this? A scaling and D scaling, okay. Farewell, Ashen One. 
I don't... I don't think you can use any, like, buffs on this weapon. Yeah, no. Maybe you can buff it with, like, uh, what? Like a weapon buff, but... I'm not sure. Yeah, I still can't believe that they have all these... Oh, I'm gonna go use those Estus shards. I still can't believe that they actually have all these, uh... Bloodborne weapons in DS3. It's so fucking cool, honestly. Alright, let's go do the Watchers. Apparently, I think they're trying to, they're trying to add these, like, Bloodborne weapons into, uh, Cinder's mod, with, like, the transform movesets and everything. It, man, I can't, I can't even imagine what, what the modding scene for the Souls games are gonna look like in a few years from now. You're gonna have, like, every single Bloodborne weapon in the game, you're gonna have, like, it's just, it's gonna be fucking crazy. I have no, I don't really know how they, they ported all the Bloodborne movesets and weapons into the game. It's probably because of modded PS4s, I guess. Oh, okay. At least I didn't get poisoned. I'm gonna have blood vials too. Alright, I'm quitting out. I'm not in the mood to get poisoned here. Mo modded all in the one game with all the bosses too. Yeah, can you imagine that? Takes a lot of time. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't even be surprised if down the line somebody just like fucking ports Bloodborne to PC. Obviously it would be illegal as fuck. <laughs> but... There's room- yeah, there's rumors that Bloodborne's coming to PC, but they're full of shit, basically. Oh, come on. Alright, let's- let's- let's saw him. Okay. He does not know what to do against that. Hehehehe. <laughs> Wouldn't that be like having a ROM of an S SNES game? No, not really. I mean, like, like for example, the SM6 people, people like Deke. I don't know what they, I don't know how they did it, but basically, people made a PC version of SM64, and Nintendo was not happy. They like pursued like finding it online is extremely difficult because Nintendo was not not happy about it. <clears throat> Nintendo doesn't like anything, yeah, that's true. Can you backstab with this weapon? I don't even know. 
Ooh, that's big damage. Fucking 57. levels this it's plus four <laughs> fucking rip dude This is so fucking cool, dude. I never thought I'd be able to use the Whirly Gig saw in fucking blood. Oh, this soul looks weird. The fuck? Yeah, I never, I never thought I'd be able to use fucking Whirly Gig saw in this game. It's crazy, man. Yeah, the, the entire move sets in the game. You can transform it. You can use the one-handed mode. You can also... You can spin it. does have the saw cleaver. There's eight weapons in this mod right now. There's the Rakuyo, the stake driver, the saw cleaver, Ludwig's holy sword, Whirligig saw, uh, the blades of mercy I believe, the Kirk hammer, and one other weapon. I can't remember which. No, you can't buff it. No tumble buff? Well, this mod only works on current patch. So, oh my god, these fucking rats. Uh, yeah, it only works on current patch, so you can't... Also, what's going on, Pest? Uh, you can't... ...do tumble buff on current patch. Did I try buffing the untransformed? Uh, no. No, you, yeah, you can't buff it either way. Yeah, no, this weapon has A scaling. This thing is- this thing is a fucking beast. <laughs> I don't really think this mod is, like, super balanced for PvE. This saw is probably gonna shit on, like, most of the bosses, especially when I get high stats. But... That's fine. I don't mind. <laughs> but yeah, they, they've been adding, like... They've been updating the mod a lot, so... They will prob- I mean, at some point, I wouldn't be surprised if all of the Bloodborne weapons, you know, end up in the- uh, end up in this mod. Can you tumble buff with the bow glitch? Uh... I don't think so.
All right, I'm probably gonna one-shot this bracelet here. Yep. <laughs> Mr. Rolnir. Yeah, so you you press triangle to transform the weapon in this mod. It's not L1. L1 is still block. The only thing that you can't do with this mod is uh am I playing anything after DS3 today? Uh I might do some Hollow Knight runs or D rest. Continue D resting Doom. I don't really know. We'll see. Uh, but yeah, you can't you can't transform the weapon while running. It, it just ends up doing like a normal attack, well, a transform attack. But they are they are gonna release a patch, I believe, which like makes it like pretty much exactly the same <laughs> so many bones yeah cinder's mod is really good d rest deadly premonition and add it to your marathons uh, deadly premonition is just too like it's too long of a game The trial of persistence being carried by Rocky. Nice. He does 4k damage on the rolls? Wait, really? I don't think he did that much damage. For me, that's crazy. There's a work in progress mod in Skyrim that adds Bloodborne stuff. They added a flying amygdala. <laughs> what the fuck? That does sound very strange. Deadly Premonition Recce is 3 hours 38 minutes. Who has it by the- is it- does Maxi Lobes have the Recce for Deadly Premonition? Basically like nobody runs that game. Try the scimitar? <laughs> Have you used the scimitar enough?
Oh, Maxi doesn't even have a... What the fuck? There's like three people that ran Deadly Premonition recently on Switch. So weird. Insanely active community, I guess. Yeah, Maxi has it on the director's cut version, which I guess is like the PC version, I think. Maybe he plays it on... I know there's also like an Xbox 360 version. And a... Uh... There, the P I played it on PS3 myself. Apparently the best version is Xbox 360, I've heard. going on in chat? People saying that these games are unfinished? I know that, like, DS1... I mean, there's a difference between, like, being unfinished and being, like, rushed. Like, DS2 and DS1 were both rushed. Uh... I'm not... I don't really... I don't know about... I don't feel like Bloodborne or Sekiro was rushed at all. But I know DS2 had like a really bad development cycle. DS2 rushed how? I mean, if, if you look up they actually had way more plans for DS2, but they were... They had to hit like a deadline in DS2. Oh, yo, also Wayward, thank you for the five months, man. Thank you very much. Uh, okay. Jeez, what? Plus seven, dude. Let's go. Well, then. Farewell, Ashen One. The bridge from Firelink to Capra Demon. <laughs> yeah, no. All the all the games are one hundred percent finished. Uh. But there, you can you can tell that some areas were do, were were rushed to an extent. I mean, like for example, with um, well, let's go do dancer. With uh, DS one, there like towards, I know Isolith has a lot of. You could tell that Isolith was definitely like rushed to an extent. But yeah. Unfinished is not uh, not a good way to put it. Hey, also Paulo Henrique. Henrique, thank you for the prime sub, man. 
thank you very much, sir. Is DS3 rushed? I mean, I don't really know. I, I I feel like DS3 is very well polished. I mean, all the bo like there's not very all the bosses in DS3 feel super unique to me. I don't feel like there's any same samey bosses. So. They cut much of the cool stuff. I mean, that wasn't because that wasn't because of it being rushed, though. It's just they didn't they didn't want that in the game. Trying to go for headshots. So a lot of people don't know, you can headshot Dancer. Okay. Hey, I'm still using the saw. <laughs> you want me to saw her butt? Is that what you want? She's too fast. She's outrunning it. Whose weapon is this? Uh, this is Bloodborne's weapon. <laughs> Mr. Bloodborne. <laughs> yeah, you... This mod... This mod adds eight different Bloodborne weapons to the game with their full movesets. Uh, you get... You can just buy them in Firelink Shrine. John Bloodborne. <laughs> Is there every weapon of Bloodborne in this mod? No, like I said, it's... Like I just said, there's only eight. There's eight different weapons from Bloodborne. There is the saw cleaver, kirk hammer, stake driver, whirligig saw, rakuyo, blade of mercy, 
Uh, can't remember. I, I, I don't even know which ones I've set at this point. But yeah. There's eight different weapons. Oh, Ludwig's Holy Sword. Is the cleaver enormously OP? I've heard it's pretty OP, yes. I don't <laughs> I don't know if it actually is. I haven't tried it. I mean I'm pr I'm probably gonna do a run of like all with all the bloodborne weapons, to be honest. Yeah, this mod actually has the animations, which is crazy. I don't know... I, I heard that, like, Cinder is going... is... Cinder's is, like, working with the people who made this mod to get the... To get the transforms in Cinder's mod as well. Hey, Quirk. What? Let's go to go do uh, Osiris now. Yo, Nombres, what's up, man? Dang, I still can't believe Trey just came in and dropped a fucking hundred gift subs. Rukuyo has the full move set. Yep. Yes, it does. All the Bloodborne weapons in this mod have have the full move set. He does this all the time for Nems. Yeah. I've heard <laughs> uh, that's what Dark was saying. Yeah, there are a bunch of Bloodborne weapons in in Cinder's mod, but they they don't have the move sets. I don't know if I've ever seen I don't know if I've seen Trey in my stream before. Yeah, it's cool to see him stop by. Oh, Nems is doing good, guys. He's just taking a break. He'll be back, stronger than ever. You ignorant slaves, finally take a notice. <laughs> He's practicing fence skip. Is Tsushima out? Beloved Ocelot, uh. It is, in some countries.
will I try other weapons after this run? Uh, no. I mean, I I don't want to I don't want to like go overboard with DS3. I'm just gonna do this one run today, but I'll, I'll definitely do some more of runs like this in the future. I mean, it's really cool that they have all the Bloodborne weapons in this mod. It's fucking sick, honestly. Using the saw on DS3 bosses is really tough, I gotta say. They just love to fucking move around so much. Oh yeah, there we go. That saw's crotch. <laughs> My controller sticky now. This controller is actually working really nice. This controller feels pretty good. Why is this? Th this thing is also scuffed as fuck. It's so weird. It, in Cinder's mod, that thing was also scuffed. I don't know why. I would like to saw him, but I really can't. <laughs> it's he's too he's too fast.
I'm gonna hit him with the charged R2. Oh, or I didn't mean to do that, but that works too. <laughs> Oh, head crab, bruh. Enough. <laughs> we get it. You think the ga you think all Souls games are unfinished? That's fine. I keep track of how many times I finished each title? No. He's not being toxic? I'm not saying he's being toxic, but... I mean, I feel like... I feel like we've heard it all at this point. Uh, Alright, let's get some more bones. Drop sherbet? Vanilla sherbet? Tasteless sherbet? Licorice? <laughs> Tasteless? <laughs> vanilla. Let's get some vanilla sherbet, guys. <laughs> it did nothing. It did nothing! <laughs> Peach. I don't know if I can make it heavy, but I'm gonna try. Hello, friend. I'll take that gem, thank you. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's just, it's very stupid to say that a game's unfinished because there's areas of the game that were not included in the final release. Like, just because there's areas that are not included in the game doesn't necessarily mean that they were unfinished. It just means that they, they started working on it, and they didn't, they didn't like it to the point where they wanted to include it in the final game. Or they, they didn't feel like it fit with the themes, or they, you know, there's, there's much more to, than just like, Oh, this there's an area that was in the game, but now it's but now it's not or like there's an area left over in the game Like stuff gets scrapped because the developers don't like it or you know, they feel like there's it's more than just oh We're too lazy to finish it Oh, I can't I can't infuse it 
grip it. Oh wait, I can reinforce this. What? <laughs> a movie with deleted scenes unfinished. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's a good analogy. <laughs> Why do I feel like you're telling us what we already know? I mean, yeah, you're right. Majority of people do know that. I just wanted to voice my opinion on the subject matter that we are all talking about here. I mean, in my opinion, de deadlines de deadlines aren't necessarily a bad thing. They can be, but games can end up in development hell when there's no fucking deadlines in place. got ghosts anybody can play ghosts right now if you want to play ghosts right now make a New Zealand PlayStation account PlayStation Store account and buy it and you can play it right now if you want if you haven't bought it already also handed out early copies to some yeah they handed it out to all the people in chat I'm sure no need no need guys you hear that they handed out early copies everybody in chat gets one It's a quick little shave. All that and can I mean, XQC didn't get an early copy. He actually, he he made a, a New Zealand PSN account. Well, he did the same thing with like Last of Us 2 as well, I think. But yeah, he didn't get an early copy. 
He just made a New Zealand account and bought it early. I honestly would have I would have started my stream with Ghost of Tsushima if I knew about that. But uh I'm also happy to do this. This is also quite enjoyable. No, you can't get all the Bloodborne weapons. There's eight, eight different Bloodborne weapons that are currently in this mod. Although they're adding more, like over time. I mean, it, it all depends on the publisher, right? When it comes to deadlines. Some publishers... You know, they, they work with the devs and they they talk with the devs to understand if the game needs more time. And if it does, then they generally grant it. Now there's some publishers that do not grant that do not give that option. For example, Capcom with RE3 remake, they probably said the devs were probably like, you know, there's a lot of there's a lot of the original that isn't in the remake yet. But uh but, uh, you know, I think, we sh I think we should work on it for, like, six more months. And Capcom says, well, you know, you c it, it has a start and a finish, right? Well, yeah, but we still need to work on it. Well, uh, ship it, ship it. It's fine. You know, that's the difference. Capcom probably told them to make it linear from the start. Yeah, I mean, I'm obviously just, I'm just, I'm, I'm just like joking. Like, I have no idea what the development process for RE3 Remake was, but you get my point. No, the running R2 transformation actually works. I was just dumb. This is the running, the running R2. The only thing that you can't do. You can't, you can't transform the weapon while running. Like, you know, in Bloodborne you can just constantly keep transforming while you're running. That, that doesn't work in this. But it's not a huge deal. Like, you have to be standing still to transform it. If you're moving forward, it does the transform attack. But I believe they're... They are... There's gonna be a pat like an update for this for this mod in the future where they fix that Hey Lalo Oh, also, Mr. Toodles, thank, thank you for the 29 months. If you read this, you are Gachi Gasm. Oh, I think he meant to say you are gay, Gachi Gasm. But you said cat. And we have S scaling now. 
Yes, I will be playing Ghost of Tsushima. But I don't I don't have an early access copy. And I already I bought the game this morning. And I believe you can't get refunds on the Sony store, so I could play it early if I made a New Zealand PSN account, but I don't know if it's worth paying $60 to play a game like 10 hours early. I mean, it might be, considering there's probably a lot of people that want to watch it right now, but yeah, I don't know. I might just, I'll probably just wait for tomorrow. Everyone donate a dollar to the cause. <laughs> Everybody donate a dollar if you want to see Ghost of Tsushima today. <laughs> I mean, if somebody donates and says they want me to play it today, I'll do it. <laughs> sell out? It's not sell out. What do you mean? It's, what do you mean sell out? It's. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> okay, guys. <laughs> it's not like I'm getting the money and then not. What the fuck? It's not like I'm getting the money and then not using it. <laughs> Alright, we got we got three bucks from Tahail. And we got a dollar from Walter Ego. That's four dollars, chat. That's four dollars already. Holy fuck. Twelve sixty one? Jesus Christ, that's some insane damage. This turned into a sellout. <laughs> okay. Okay, dude. Whatever. <laughs> okay. Oh, look, we got it. We did it, guys. $60 from Jamie. <laughs> well, there we go. <laughs> that was easy. <laughs> Oh man. <laughs> and Kenny K. Kenny K with the 15 bucks. My donation goes towards Ghost of Tsushima 18 hour stream. Yo, that's a pog. I pre ordered. Uh. No, well, I don't know. I, I just. I bought it for $60 on the PSN store today. Time to change category. <laughs> Already made money from it. Oh man. <laughs> All right, well, I guess uh I guess we're playing sushi today, guys. If you didn't download on PS, you can refund the game. Well, I did already download it, so yeah, rip. Got to donate for the optional incentives. Well, I guess we're going to play uh play ghosts, guys, after this run. <laughs> I'm, I'm not gonna did it come out a day early so you can you can make a New Zealand PSN account and then play the game early that way XQC is doing it so I'm sure it's fine <laughs> oh my god what the heck what? <laughs> toaster nugget and oh my god what is happening <laughs> Everybody, guys, <laughs> guys, I already hit the goal. <laughs> what the fuck? 
Oh, not my bagel. Thank you for the 10 bucks. He said, ghost 18 hour stream also. And toaster nugget with the 60 bucks said, do it. I don't have a PS4. I need to live through you. <laughs> And Swesterly with the 500 bits saying, Ghost, please. And to hail with the five bucks, this is also for the 18 hour stream. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> All right, well, you can uh, buy a few copies of Ghosts, I guess. <laughs> uh, the fuck, dude. <laughs> Oh, that's actually fucking hilarious. Yeah, Zurich Da, thank you for the 420, man. Sellout Stream Inc. 300 bits for Senator Crab. Saying 18 hours or else. More bits, I guess? Oh my god, this skip with controller is so hard. Wait, do I have my... No, I don't. Thank, thank you, guys. I new controller <laughs> yeah yeah maybe I should buy a new controller all right you know what fuck this I'm not doing the skip Guys, I would really appreciate $60 for a new controller. That would be... <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I'm just joking. I'm just joking. <laughs> hey, Drexia, thank you for the 15 months, man. <laughs> Nems! Yo, thanks for the 47 months. Go back and do the skip now. <laughs> it's, too, it's too late, Nems. Too late. Marty over here. <laughs> I I know toaster nugget. I'm I'm just joking. The, you know, actually this controller that I'm using right now is is working pretty well though. I'm not having any issues. Like there's no stick drift. It's not sticky. It's doing it's doing pretty good. Screenshot Amazon receipt. I, uh, you might be able to change your main account's time zone to New Zealand. I don't think that works. I'm pretty sure when you make the PSN account, like, there's different PlayStation stores for specific, um, there's different PlayStation stores for, for each, like, region. So you need, you need to have an account for that specific region. But yeah, thank you guys for the for the donations. I <laughs> I really appreciate it. game has unskippable cutscenes. Nice. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yo, Zurich Da. Thank you for the 20 bucks. He said controller fund get. Yo, that's a pog. Guys, only 40 more di <laughs> I'm just joking. <laughs> Thank you, Zerkta. Thank you, man. <laughs> There's no NG plus. Did you did you buy the game, Nems? Are you gonna play it? <laughs> just joking, but not really. No, I just like triggering chat, so <laughs> I'm sorry.
waiting for midnight, you're gonna play all day like Sekiro for a week. Nice. I'm hoping it's good. I really have no idea what to expect. Wingstop lunch fund? No, you. I I already have my lunch fund. You guys literally just donated like 150 bucks. I can buy a controller. I can buy a controller. The freaking game. I can buy lunch. I can buy dinner. I can buy dinner tomorrow. <laughs> Show off. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yo, thank you for the thank you for the gift sub uh pantsu to crunchy. What am I gonna order to eat? I don't know, I actually kinda wanna, wanna order food soon. Yo, what's up, Dream? It's a mod called Champion's Ashes. Yeah, it's it's really cool. They, they have the entire, like, they have eight different Bloodborne weapons in, in this mod right now. With, uh... The full movesets. Yo, Rafik, thank you for the Prime sub, man. Do I need a new PS5? No. I can I can cover my PS5 on my own. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Yo. <laughs> this is so stupid. <laughs> Yo, Zurich Da, thanks for the 20 bucks. Saying pizza fun get. I was thinking about ordering a deep dish pizza, but some of my viewers have been expressing concerns over how much I eat pizza lately. So I've been I've been a bit I've been a bit uh apprehensive about ordering pizza. <laughs> okay, that that attack is not going to work. It does the damage when it hits the ground. Killing bosses with a pizza cutter, that's true. That is true. with this weapon. Maybe you can use, like, spell buffs? Hit him in the head, dude. I 
guess I'm just gonna keep hitting the left hand. <coughs> I just, I really wanna get a, uh... Weapon transform. There we go. Alright, let's saw his face. <laughs> okay, guys. Enough memes about the donations, okay? Yo, Zerk, uh, thanks for the two bucks. Ran out of money, but play Ghost while eating pizza on the base camp. Please love me. <laughs> Thanks, sir. <Erica. laughs> Ooh, big damage. No, this isn't Cinders. This is a different mod. <laughs> we got scammed. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna cancel this sick run, dude. Uh, Alright, let's go do Pontiff and Eldritch. It does have Saw Cleaver Mario. I've also heard it's very overpowered. Yo, Miguel, thank you for the bits, man. Thank you very much, dude. No, I'm actually, I'm, I'm having a lot of fun doing this. It's, it's really cool to use Bloodborne weapons in DS3. I mean, one of my, like, favorite things is to do meme runs in DS3, but I've done meme runs with, like, every fucking weapon. So it's, it's nice to, to use it with different weapons that I've never done before. Ghost of Tsushima is $80 USD from New Zealand. Are you memeing or are you being serious? I have no idea. Maybe. <laughs> you paid 42 for Tsushima? How, how, how'd you do that? For cards, rapier, weapon art only with DLCs. Oh man. Again, thank you. Thank you for the bits, Miguel. Also, yo, Drags, thank you for the two months, man. Since punching is buffed in this mod, you should do an all-punching run. Yeah, I mean, I could do a fist-only run with this mod. Hey, Fluff. Good morning. Oh, yeah, let's put on Pontiff's ring. Uh, nice parry. Uh, I swear I know how to play this game, guys. Mate, I can... Chill. I want to parry you. Come charge me. Oh my god. Uh... Nice. Good parry. <laughs> I'm 
bust out the saw. When you tap L1, it like gives you like hyper armor or something momentarily. I guess that's a change in the mod. I don't know. I don't actually know. I guess I guess you can like time time it like if you if you know you're gonna get hit you can do that. Yo, what's up, Emwa? Hey, thank you, man. Motivated you to start streaming. I hope you're uh, hope you're having fun streaming, dude. It transforms with triangle. So it's a little bit different than in like Bloodborne, but in Bloodborne doesn't have a block button, so most of the changes are for PvP. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah, thank you for the gift sub, Emwa. Thank you, man. block is L2 yeah well that's and that's only because like I mean there's only like two shields in Bloodborne anyways and blocking blocking is is a meme in Bloodborne it pretty much does nothing <laughs> tried learning DS2 any percent earlier this year got meme too many times yeah Well, the lock, I think the lock shield is actually decent because it it gives you like a bunch of magic resist or like magic defense, so it's not bad. Or yeah, it's arcane defense, I think. To Estus. Forgot to rest at the bonfire. Yeah, it is good versus... It, <laughs> it's weird, but a, a wooden shield is actually surprisingly useful against guns in Bloodborne. It's pretty much like all it's good for. Them shields were against the AK. <laughs> yeah. Yo, Bob, thank you for the three year reset, man. Fucking hell, that charge start too does so much damage. 
Oh yeah, right, I have backstep attacks too. I never, I, w I didn't even think about trying that. Yeah, thank you for the three years, Bob. And Kalos, thank you for the 31 months. Amygdalan arm. Amygdalan arm isn't in DS3, but I might do a run of it in, like, Bloodborne soon. We'll see. I've been having fun doing, doing like, me just like a meme run of a Souls game every day. Are the YouTube comments still annoyed by Pug Please? Most people actually like it. I get a lot of YouTube comments where people are like, I was I wanted to watch your video, but I just ended up staring at the pug for the entire thing. <laughs> but uh Occasionally you get the one guy that's like, this pug I couldn't even watch this video. That pug was so distracting, it ruined it. I'm like, dude. <laughs> like, okay. <laughs> yeah, it's Nova on alt accounts. Oh gosh, I have two S. Th I thought I only had one S this shard. Pug is ugly? How- how dare you? Is the pug scratching? It's- it's dancing. Yo, Nems38's mum. Thank you so much for the 17 months. Glad you're enjoying the stream, Mama Nems. <laughs> oh yeah, also Mick Fire Shots. Thank you for the Prime sub, man. Why don't I have sub sounds? Uh, I muted sub notifications because they get. Well, I'll turn them on for now. Uh, I should. A lot of the time, I'll well, like I'll mute them if there's. Sorry. Um, I'll generally mute the sub notifications if if there's like a bunch of gift subs at once. It can get kind of annoying hearing very good indeed, like, a hundred times in a row. So I- the last- like, I muted it last time because of that, and I just haven't unmuted it since. I'll- I'll try to remember to leave them on, though. As long as there aren't, it's not like constant notifications. God damn it. You know, I wonder if this, if the saw works for, uh, I wonder if it works with Pontiff's eye. Holy shit. Do I have a favorite boss in this game? Probably Half-Light. The Spear of the Church. The glorious boss. Very 
No, probably, probably Gale. I would, I would probably say Gale. Yo, Davis Lobo, thank you for the 14 months. Thank you, Davis. Can you make a specific sub alert for gifted subs? Uh, maybe? I don't know. I haven't really messed with my notifications in a long time. But you probably can. Uh, I should ch I should change that. Fix it. You can still do pretty good damage on SL1. I mean, it's not amazing, but... Yeah, if I remember, I'll, I'll try to fix that for gift subs. So I don't have to mute it when I get a bunch- if I get a bunch of gifted subs. Because I, I know it can get annoying just hearing the same notification over and over again. Yeah, I've had the dog with the ball as my notification for, I don't even know, like five years. <laughs> but, uh... Oh, you did it with no upgrades? I see. Yeah, that's, that's pretty rough then. I did actually change it at one point when I was running getting over it. I had a getting over it sub notification. <laughs> DS2 SL1 is pretty fun. I think D I think SL1 DS2 is the hardest out of all the Souls games. Yeah, I'm gonna play Ghost of Tsushima. In fact, I'm gonna be playing it after this run. Uh, apparently you can play it if you... If you make a New Zealand PSN account. Although I'm gonna have to download it. So maybe I should, maybe I should take a break like mid-run and, and do that. So I don't have to just sit here and wait for the download. That's probably a good idea. What's the rush to play it? Well, I said that if I got donated $60, I would buy the game. Well, okay, so I already bought the game on my US PSN account. But I said if I got if I got a sixty dollar donation, I would buy it. I would make a New Zealand account and buy it again <laughs> and play it early today. So, and people donated for it. So, yeah. I'm not baiting. I'm I'm explaining what happened. Okay. <laughs> Please. taking advantage of people's kindness. I Listen, I didn't say that people had to do it. I was perfectly content with playing it tomorrow. That's stupid instead of waiting for a few hours for the NA release. I mean, it's more than a few hours. But yeah, it is... I mean, it is kind of stupid buying a game twice, but hey, we're supporting the developers. Whatever. Chat paid for it, so I'll do it. Very 
very good. Very <laughs> good. Sir, die. You said you're out of money. Stop. Another Stop donating. <laughs> Welcome, unkindled one. Purloiner of cinders. Mind you, the mantle of Lord interests me none. The fire-linking curse, the legacy of lords, let it all fade into nothing. You've done quite enough. Now have your rest. Well, the new I don't even think the New Zealand version is any different compared to the US version. It's it's pretty much the same. It's just you can play it earlier. Oh, dear brother. I'm on my Dude, way. he got fucking destroyed. <laughs> yeah, my first playthrough of DS3, I think the hardest boss for me was Princes. I was also using like a slow weapon which made it a lot harder. For that is our curse. Yeah, I put, well, I didn't, I put on Pontiff's ring, so. I mean, I don't, I don't know if it's working, but. I don't have another ring that I can use anyway, so it doesn't really matter. This weapon is so good, dude. Holy shit. So I do think, though, I mean, I have the DLCs left. I, I should actually... I should probably try to start downloading... the game right now. I don't, I don't think that my US copy of the game is going to work, so I'm probably gonna have to re-download it. I probably should try to do that right now so I don't just have to sit here and wait shit where the hell is my where the hell is my control All right, I'm just gonna continue with the mod. Whatever. I I don't know. I am disappointed right now, but I'm not really sure what to do. I tried buying like a digital code, but I also it also like 
It also oh, said that it doesn't work. Good. So very good indeed. I don't know. I don't know what to do. Every avenue is is a failure for me right now. Yo, thank you so much for the 41 months, Spiral King. Thank you, dude. I tried using PC game supply, but uh, yeah, it it, it it it's just like rejecting my payment for some reason. So I don't know what to do. Good. Can join Very us good as indeed. living failures in the next Bloodborne run. Brilliant. Yo, d -Scythe, thank you for the gift sub, man. Could have tried the privacy website. Generates virtual cards that doesn't need to be tied to US address. Hmm. No, you can't you can't gift on PSN. Well the the whole the whole idea is to make is to make uh <laughs> inserts completely shady idea. Uh, yeah, I, 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 this mod's really cool, I gotta say. Uh, Aether. I'm still like... <clears throat> oh, very good. Very oh, my good game indeed. crashed. I still can't believe that, uh... I still can't believe you guys have all these Bloodborne weapons in the mod. Sorry, I'm, I'm just I'm I'm all thr I'm all thrown about right now because of this this stupid shit. You can buy PSN New Zealand card. I was trying, but the website I was trying to use didn't work. <clears throat> well, I tried I tried placing an order through PC Game Supply on PayPal. And it like, they like rejected my order, I guess. I'm not actually sure why. Why we need Kiwi Cash for PSN. Well, basically, so I bought the game. I already bought the game uh, on my US PSN account. But then <clears throat> people were telling me that XQC was like playing it early because he has like a New Zealand PSN account. And he was. <clears throat> He was a uh, like you can you can just play it early if you if you have the game on a New Zealand account. So I was just memeing. I was like, if you guys donate, I'll buy the game again and play it today, or I'll play it this stream. And a bunch of people donated. So now I was trying to do I was trying to frickin' uh, I was trying to do it, but I'm having a bunch of issues. Memeing, I mean. Maybe it's not, it's not a meme, like, I guess, I don't know, it was just a joke, but I, I should have assumed that somebody was actually going to do it. 
Anyways, I was tr I I've spent like the past 30 minutes trying to set this shit up, but I I just it's been it's been a mess. Don't see the point in trying so hard to play a game half a day early. Well, people donated for it, so I I thought I would at least try. I mean, if I say that I'm going to do something, even if I'm joking, like and people donate, I'm not I would feel bad if I at least didn't try, you know? Yeah, I know Ko's not doing region stuff, but I don't have an early copy, so... You're explaining to the guy in chat. Oh, okay. Agree to a full playthrough if you can't get it early. Well, what do you mean? I mean, I'm I'm planning I'm planning on playing the game in the first place. I don't. Know, I, I just feel bad now because people donated for it, and now now I like interrupted this run for like half an hour to try to do something which I can't. I it seems like I'm not even gonna be able to do. So I don't know. I just I just feel bad. Jump attack. Oh my god. There's Australian cards on G2A. Is there? I was I was checking G2A but I couldn't find them. I could try G2A if you have a link for it. G2A is sketch as fuck. I don't think it really is. Okay, are do jump attacks not work? I mean, guys, it's not- G2A isn't a scam. Pretty sure it's fine. How do you steal keys anyways? How does that work? stolen keys from sellers okay yeah I have no idea guys I haven't really looked into all that stuff you bought ESO on G2A and your copy was banned oh no man that it has been so long since I've actually done wyvern legit I'll be back in a sec. I need to go use the restroom.
Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that, guys. Sorry about that. Hold on, I'm gonna try one last thing. I don't think it's gonna work, but... Okay, whatever. I give up. I don't know. I tried. I tried everything I could. Rip. Sorry, fellas. All right, let's just let's just get back with with some DS3. Is it downloading? No. I, uh, I don't know, the the one website that sells, like, the New Zealand DSN cards, I, I tried placing an order with PayPal, but for some reason, like, I don't know, they, it got, like, scuffed or something, and the, the order got denied, so now, like, I basically can't place any other orders through that website. I should have just used my credit card in the first place, because I think it would have been fine then. But yeah, now nah, it's just all, it's all scuffed now for Australia PSN cards. Uh, I'm looking for New Zealand. I, I I assume they're different, but I don't actually really... Yeah, it's... It's whatever. It's a rip. I'm sorry, guys. Yeah, I was trying to play Ghost of Tsushima early, but it ended up being a bit more complicated than I thought, so... Oh, 
Australia would maybe work, yeah. It's like 5 a.m. in New Zealand, yeah. Yeah, I, w I was doing the Bloodborne dashes earlier. I don't really have like a super lightweight armor set though. Otherwise, I would try that. I don't know. I don't know if armor is like changed in this mod, but I know. Like in DS3, normally armor is kind of rough. Um. Where like if you if you don't have certain armor pieces on, you'll take like so much more extra damage. Dang, I wanted to post this run on YouTube. Maybe I'll still post it on YouTube, but I feel bad that it's got like a 45 minutes of me fucking trying to do this stupid shit. Use the YouTube editor to remove that bit. Oh, yeah, that's true. I could do that. Well, the thing is, if I... A, a, a Japanese account, if I bought the game from with the Jap, through the Japanese PSN store, the game will be in Japanese. And I don't really want that. <laughs> no, this weapon is not vanilla. This is a Bloodborne weapon. Yeah, no, I can use the YouTube editor. I've, I've actually used it before a few times. I'm still curious how they managed to get the Bloodborne weapons in the game. Oh, come on. for the mod is still in the chat. His name's Aether. They're directly ported from Bloodborne. Gotcha. Do you guys have plans of adding, like, more Bloodborne weapons in the future? Yo, what's up, Peck? Yeah, it's, it's sick. I never thought I'd be able to use Bloodborne weapons in DS3. <laughs> the goal is to add all of them, dang. That's so cool. I'm excited for the Logarius wheel. <laughs> Next update has three more coming. Are you allowed to say which ones? <laughs> or is it a secret? It's fine if it's a secret. Thank you. They are 
ash never fade. Holy Moonlight Just Sword and Beast Cutter. Oh, nice. The painting of Ariandel. Well, rotted scrap of it, that is. Go on. Take yeah, I'm, I'm planning on doing like a run of a. Uh, I want to do a run with all the Bloodborne weapons in this game. I'm not sure which one I'll do next. Maybe Stake Driver. Kirk Hammer. I don't know. And then the ashes were too. <laughs> Oh, you guys did add the extra damage? That's cool. Oh, there's a video for the the weapons from 14 hours ago. I see. Transform really good, has the hollow bonus, gotcha. Yeah, I, w I was wondering if there was like, if you guys added serrated bonus or the holy bonus. Or the righteous bonus. This won't give you the Bloodborne PC that you want, well, it's the closest thing you can get right now. Eventually you'll be able to play DS3 with all the Bloodborne weapons at least. <laughs> yeah, no, you can trick them. You can't do it while running, although I think that they're planning on changing that so you can do it while running, but not that that's not a huge deal anyways, but uh, I don't know if you can buff any of the trick weapons. You can't buff the saw, for example. Bloodborne weapons can't be buffed as of right now, gotcha. Yeah, it would be cool to see the Whirligig saw with like gold pine resin. Although I wouldn't be surprised, you know, like if in the future they... They figure out how to... How to do it. They can't buff them because of texture issues. Yeah, I'm sure it's something... Something along those lines. Tsushima's already out in New Zealand. It came out, like, New Zealand... I think it came out, I don't even know, quite a, quite a while ago. Like, this morning? Super, like, early this morning, I guess? Not sure. One of my running Tsushima. Well, I was gonna play it this stream, and I tried making a New Zealand PSN account so I could play it early, but uh, it ended up being way more complicated than I thought, so I'm probably just gonna play it tomorrow. Why do games still release like that? Yeah, I don't know. It's it's pretty dumb. I don't have the XQC brain. Well, as far as I know, 
Uh, the he just has somebody from his chat, maybe like a mod or somebody he trusts, who just logs into the account for him and buys it. Well, it's, he doesn't even need to trust anybody. He just has he just he has a New Zealand account and he lets he gives somebody the info and they just buy it for him. So. I mean, the, f the thing is, you don't even need to have somebody you trust enough to, to buy it. Like, I mean, if you make a brand new PSN account and you give somebody the info and there's nothing on it, like, what does it matter if, like, okay, sure, they, they get access to an account that has no games on it, no info on it. It's just a brand new, fresh account. Like, if they're not going to buy it, then whatever. Or if they, like, change the password, then just make a new account. <laughs> like, it doesn't really matter, you know? Are there a lot of people playing on banned servers with this mod? I'm not actually sure. Maybe? I- I don't- I haven't done DS3 PvP in like a year or two. I imagine there's probably a- There's probably a little bit of a community for it. Well, even if I can't play Ghost of Tsushima early, I will... I mean, I have the New Zealand account made now. In the future, if there's a game that I want to play like a day early, I'll, I'll, buy it, I'll buy it through there and I'll just get like a PSN card or something. Will I speedrun it? I mean, I haven't even played it. I, <laughs> I have no idea. Well, there's a few games that I know that I like I know I'm gonna speedrun before I even play them, but most of the time I'm going to play a game first before I decide if I actually want to speedrun it. Your account's been banned for two years because you use no crash patch online. Really? You got banned for that? I didn't think the no crash patch could, could cause a ban. Is that the only thing you've done? It's kind of surprising. I heard that you can't skip cutscenes in Ghost, so... Any modification to any file flags that count? Oh, okay. The new game Gamer Girl coming out for PS4? <laughs> What makes me decide to speedrun? I mean, normally it's just if it's a game that I enjoy. That's the most important thing to me. Well, I wouldn't worry about getting banned on DS3 because you can... Well, I mean, I guess it's kind of annoying, like... You can family share DS3 to a different Steam account and play it that, like, play it that way on an unbanned unbanned account, but obviously you're gonna have to, like, make a new character, which some people, you know, don't... Some people, like, you know, have their characters they're invested into, whatever, so they might not want to make a new character. I mean, I can play Ghost of Tsushima later tonight, but I can't play it this... I'm not gonna be playing it this stream, I don't think. <laughs> yeah, you can use Cheat Engine and make <laughs> and make a character. I mean, if you know how to use Cheat Engine, you can actually avoid getting banned pretty easily. As long as you don't, like, modify your character stats, I believe you can avoid ban- like, you won't get banned.
can move a save from an unbanned account to the one you... I don't... Th is, is there a save transfer tool? Gets the account you moved the save to banned, oh, but yes. Oh, very <laughs> okay. Good. Very good indeed. All right, I have a feeling this guy's gonna get bullied. Oh, that's not bad. I saw that. Oh, on, I gotta get rid of my shield. I saw the weapon art for this. Drax, thank you for the 19 months, man. And BRI, thank you for the prime sub. BRL? My bad. <laughs> My bad, dude. Do level ups cost less in this mod? I feel like I am getting so many level ups in this mod. It's weird. <laughs> Don't think we changed that, okay. I might just... I've been playing a lot of Bloodborne lately. And yeah, I guess it's because you changed the starting class. I did start with like 23 strength on this character. They cost more in Cinder's mod, yeah. Bloodborne level ups are also very expensive, so. Tsushima is boring as fuck. Is it? <laughs> OMG, it is. Thank you so much for the gift sub, man. 
Thank you very much, dude. Misguided ash. Please avert thine eyes. I would snuff out these ashes for good. Yo, Rizzler, thank you for the four months, man. Thank you very much, dude. Is she gonna get stun locked by this? Yes. Bach. Insane splice. <laughs> Viewer runs on this mod would be possible if people don't mind playing on banned servers. <laughs> yeah, that would kind of, that would kind of be problematic though. If I mean, if like non-banned players could play on the banned servers, then it would be fine. But obviously, that wouldn't make much sense. Unlock. Wait, 
you're not getting stun locked. What the fuck, Frida? to finish her. Since I feel bad that people donated for Ghost of Tsushima early, and I I wasn't able to do it, I'm gonna give some subs. Oh. Alright, people donated like 150 bucks, so I'm gonna give 30 subs. Good. Very good indeed. <clears throat> oh, very good. Very good indeed. Oh, very good. Very good indeed. <laughs> Oh, right. Let me turn off Very good. notifications for a bit. <laughs> yeah, congrats to anybody who got a sub. So, again, sorry anybody who donated. Sorry I, I wasn't able to... Sorry I failed all of you! Ella tear skip. The, well, the worst part is I'm pretty sure I could have done it toaster nugget, but because I, the one website that's that has like instant delivery on New Zealand PSN cards. I fucking tried- I tried getting them through- I tried getting them with PayPal, and they like, re- they like declined the order for some reason, and now my account is like flagged, and I can't make another account because, like, it won't let me buy anything- it won't let me try to buy it with my credit card now because the PayPal payment got fucking declined. Uh, Make another account, like you, 
you have to put in your phone no you have to like verify with your phone number when you place an order it's like I tried making another account but my phone number is already tied to that one account so now I can't do that I don't know it's just so stupid Good, yeah. Oh wow, I still got the repost. Holy shit. I did not think I was gonna get that. Uh, there's a- they gave out a few early copies for Tsushima. Thank, thank you for the year resub, Bridbomb. Thank you, dude. I don't know. I, I could still try. I could still try to get Ghost of Tsushima early. I think I'm gonna order some lunch after this run, and I can I could see if I can get like a New Zealand PSN card. But I don't know. It's. It's not looking good. <laughs> what was the site? I was trying to just let it go. <laughs> yeah, I, I probably should. I should probably just... I should probably just let it go. I was trying to use... Uh, it's called like PC Game Supply. Combat in Ghost just looks like bad Assassin's Creed combat from looking at other streams. Looks gorgeous though. Letting it go is healthier. Yeah, I think I think you're right. Whatever, we gifted some subs. I just I just feel bad. I just feel bad. Cuphead expert maybe? Yeah, maybe. Try more, yeah. Did you did you love that, Ollie? You really want to see Ghost of Tsushima? 
He went into XQC's stream and he was ranting about Last of Us 2 again. <laughs> Drown your sorrow in some deep dish pizza. Yeah, I think I'm gonna order a deep dish pizza. I haven't had a deep dish in... Oh. <clears throat> I don't think... I haven't had a deep dish pizza in a few weeks now. Casserole? No, no, no. Don't you fucking dare say that. Cost Parasite will be one of the last Bloodborne weapons added. Gotcha. It'll be pretty complex. Or do you guys plan on on like I incorporating the the milkweed ruin and? Okay. Okay. Oh my fucking god, I can't believe I just fucking died there. But yeah, do you guys, uh... Are you guys gonna try to incorporate the Milkweed Rune? Like, how it affects the spell? How, or how, rather, how it affects the weapon? You're not too sure? Gotcha. Would work something like dragon form. Yeah, it would be it would be insane if you guys were able to do it. I don't know. I don't know if you could though. I I have no idea. But yeah, I'll I'll be using. I'll be using your guys' mod a lot, so hopefully you'll get some new people trying it out and stuff. I mean, I I'm probably gonna do a I'll probably do a run of DS3 with like every single weapon that you guys add from Bloodborne. So I know obviously it takes time, but all I have is time when I am a full-time streamer. <laughs> Fist of Gradia. I don't think they're gonna. Well, Fist of Gradia is like super basic, so I guess maybe they would add it, but I don't know if they plan on adding like guns and stuff like that. I assume it's just like main hand weapons, like the trick weapons. Because like Fist of Gradia isn't. Fist of Gradia is like a left hand weapon. mechanic yeah I really hope that <laughs> I really hope they make a mod where they change every enemy into the brain lady and they add frenzy fucking pog dude <laughs>
<laughs> I want an all enemies are are winter lanterns mod. <laughs> I'm just joking, but oh god, can you imagine? <laughs> Why are they called Winter Lanterns, anyways? Such a strange name. They're demons from folklore, what, like Japanese folklore or something? mod bosses from Bloodborne into DS3. I imagine that's a bit more complicated than modding in weapons. It would be cool if, if the modding scene got to the point though where like... <laughs> where you actually... Where, where they're actually modding in bosses from other games. But yeah, I, I can imagine it's very complicated. Although I do know, like there's a guy in the modding community um, who has, he has like analyzed uh, the, the, some, of the, some of the ways that the AI works in, like in Dark Souls 1, he was able to basically tell like how enemies perform their actions and like what what they decide to do like bosses will oh my god <laughs> uh like bosses decide they basically a <laughs> new out of bounds skip yeah Lovely. But yeah, he, he made like a giant document basically outlining the the weighting of certain boss moves. Like the chance a boss will do this depending on how far away you are or how close you are or depending on if you whiff an attack or hit an attack what type of attack you use, stuff like that. It's actually super in-depth. It's pretty cool. His name's like Meow Maridas.
It's ac he's actually helped out some of the DS1 runners figure out how to deal with like certain RNG. I don't know who made who made the floppy mod. <laughs> I have no idea. you get this weapon? Miyazaki gave it to me himself. Uh, it's a mod called Champion's Ashes. <laughs> I, I like that you guys just have all the weapons available from the Shrine anime, to be honest. say so, yeah if you guys are gonna like if you guys are gonna put the weapons in like different places around the world it would be it'd be awesome if, oh god uh it would be awesome if you guys had like the hex ids for the weapons so you could at least give them to yourself with the cheat engine but yeah if, if you're if you're just gonna have meta vendor that's fine i assume the vendor is gonna be in like firewood shrine Charge Dart 2, alright. Alright. I got you, Chris. Damn, I've used a lot of Estus on this fight. <laughs> Still a decent amount. It's 900. Hundred sixty stam, dude. Yeah, there's a lot of really cool mods for DS3 on PC.
And I'm sure in time there's gonna be even more. You know, there's gonna be even more mods added. DS3 with the DLC was 25 bucks, dang. Yeah, that's pretty cheap. Do I recommend Cinders? I do. Yeah, I have the sher sherbets. Although pe people were complaining that that the <laughs> some people were complaining that it was hurting their eyes. Not that not that that's anything that you should change. <laughs> hey Lark, thank you for the 50 months, man. Hoping that I can just bully half, uh, half life, half light, <laughs> half life. Words are hard. Shit, he has the Bloodborne Dash, too! <laughs> Get fucked. <laughs> Look at that shit, dude. He's <laughs> he's insane. <laughs> he's insane, bro. Calm down. Okay, relax. <laughs> he's using quick step. Well, either way, he normally doesn't do that. <laughs> You gave Bows a nerf version of Quick Step to remove bow casting from the game. Oh, okay, I see. He's trying to do the bow weapon art. Gotcha. Yeah, I hope that trick weapons make a return in Elden Ring. God, could you imagine if in Elden Ring there's like trick weapons and power stancing? And there's like power stance exclusive trick weapon combos? <laughs> Would be insanity. Power tricking. <laughs> oh. Now that sounds cool, Dashy. Yeah, I'm curious to see what this mod, you know, what you guys come up with for this mod in the future. FromSoft never seems to carry over certain mechanics from game to game. Yeah, that's true. But you never know. 
But yeah, that's possible. They might they might just have a brand like a entirely new mechanic for weapons, who knows? Baron Greatsword as a trick weapon with the extended boss move set. Oh, that would be so cool. Glitchy horseback souls. I mean, even if there is horse. Well, I know there is supposed to be horseback riding in Elden Ring. I'm sure they're going to make it very smooth, and it's probably going to be some of the best, like mounted combat that you'll ever see in a game you know if if FromSoft's track record is anything to go off of fanboy yeah I'm a fanboy Swimming was flawless in Sekiro. <laughs> I mean, swimming is fine in Sekiro. Sw combat underwater is kind of scuffed, though. Are there normally all these dead bodies around here? Do I just, like, never pay attention during this fucking cutscene? <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> I feel like every single time I trigger this cutscene, I look away at chat, and when I come back, it's just a- it's just Gale. Yo, Jesse, thank you so much for the year and a half resub, man. Thank you very much, sir. say Gale is like not a boss uh god damn it okay I'm like pinned against a fucking wall this is great oh my god what the fuck is happening this is not good Gale is not an easy boss to use this weapon on It's fast enough. I can't really use the. Well, just D. You can't really use the saw that effectively on DS3 bosses in general, except for like the humanoid type bosses. Yeah, you can transform. I'll transform it. What would be your ideal weapon? I mean, I I, I don't have any ideal weapon. 
I'm just saying that the weapon, like... It's, the the Whirly Gig Saw isn't even that slow. I was mainly more talking about, like, the transform attack, the, the Saw mode. Saw Cleaver would probably wreck this dude, yeah. might be dead here, by the way, guys. How much damage does Fist do? 162? <laughs> Import the Bloodborne scream into DS3. <laughs> Did I watch PVC play DS2? PVC? I guess you're talking about XQC. I don't know why he's called that, but... No, I did not. Is there a part three of the Cinders mod coming to YouTube? Yeah, I'm gonna put it on YouTube soon. I just didn't- I didn't want to spam my YouTube with the- with the Cinders mod runs. He rushed through the game with no DLC at all. I mean, that's literally all he does. He rushes through every game that he plays. He's probably going to be done with Ghost of Tsushima today. Noble Lords of Cinder. I'm sure he's literally just rushing through the entire thing. Which is fine. You know, people can play the game, play whatever game, however they want. A 
Is that a bad thing? I mean, in my opinion, I'd, I'm not a huge fan of rushing through games, but people can do what they want. I'm not going to... Not going to say that he should do anything differently. Says the speedrunner. Yeah, there's a big difference between speedrunning and casual, though. Let her grant death to the old gods of Lordran, deliverers of the first flame. I mean, there's some people who legitimately like to play games, like, who just want to play games for the story and don't do any side content and, you know, just want to rush through it. And that's fine. Honestly, like, play games the way you enjoy it, right? I don't know if XQC is rushing through games just for the views, or if that's actually how he en enjoys playing the games, but, you know, people can do whatever they want. At the end of the day, do what, do what makes you happy. Say that's fine with a slightly offended tone. I'm not offended. I mean, I disagree with it, but... Oh my god. Yeah, I'm gonna put this run on YouTube. Although I'm kind of annoyed because there's like... I'm gonna have to edit the video or something because I have like 45 minutes of me trying to... Get Last of Us 2 on the PSN store. It's your job to play thousands of games to not 100% them. Well, I feel like, if anything, if it's your job to play games, you would think... You would think the people whose jobs it is to play games would be more incentivized to experience the entire game. Day, it just depends like for me with last of us 2 for example i actually enjoyed the game at first I, I i did truly enjoy the game at first and i was taking my sweet fucking time with it but then the game the game did it it shit on my face and i i was like all right well fuck this game i'm just gonna rush through it now Yeah, like, if I'm really enjoying a game, I will take my time with it, you know? Gamers do be overdramatic? Nah, nah, I think that's perfectly... That's a perfect description of, of what Last of Us 2 does to the... does to the gamer.
<laughs> Those feel feelings aren't specific to games. Yeah, yeah, that's true. I mean, if there's a movie, a movie that I'm, I start watching and I'm like really don't like it, I'll probably just turn it off. Or a book that I'm reading that I'm, I, just doesn't, you know, grab my interest. I'll just, I'll put it down. I'll try something else. Reading books, yeah, who reads books? <laughs> you liked Last of Us 2 a lot, and you are entitled to that opinion. You are your own person. Nobody is trying to convince you otherwise. At least not here. At least not me. <laughs> the first frame quickly fades. Darkness will shortly settle. But one day, tiny flames will dance across the darkness. like embers linked by lords part yeah the, the worst part is seeing seeing the devs and neil and everybody just if, if you if you if you dislike last of us 2 you're ju you just you just hate you're just a bigot you're just ashen one Hearest thou it's my just, voice it's still? It's just awful. Alright. GG, dude. You're just a big old bigot sandwich if you dislike Last of Us 2. <laughs> I'm not saying that, by the way. That's just what, that that's that's basically what like, a lot of the fans that like Last of Us Two assume. Like if you d if you don't like it, that oh you just you just hate lesbian 